Yeah, hello and welcome. So, um, 3.18 uh, live is just released now. I think it's just like a few hours ago. And I encountered this issue. So, I'd like to see if any one of you had the same issue. So I'm going to close uh, the RSI launcher. Okay. And it's not running in the background. Let's make sure. As you can see here, it's not in the background. So, okay. Uh, let's double click. And yes. It has something to do with the login. So, um, if I say, um, I already logged in, but it still doesn't allow me to, to you know, um, uh, launch the game. So I'll log out and I'll put my email. So I just hide my screen just uh, uh, because I'll put my credential. So let's uh, maybe do. Okay. So this, I'm sorry to put this screen for you. It has nothing inside, but uh, uh, let me just log in and put my credential. Almost done. And almost there. Sign in. All right. So I just sign in now. And as you can see, I already sign in settings, um, everything there. And I always I like to, you know, quit the launcher once you close the window. When you close this window, it's, it's quit from the dot task manager. So uh, as you can see, I had the PTU. I don't want to go to the PTU. I will go to the live and then launch the game. Let's say acknowledge. And let's see if that will, uh, will I get the same error? I think the error is uh, 19,000 code the code. We will see. Hopefully it will not come back again. Uh, 3.19, my experience 3.19 uh, PTU is uh, really amazing. It's just so smooth and nice, and beautiful. I really enjoyed the 3.18, the evaluation uh, phase. I didn't, I didn't join Star Citizen for a long time. I mean, just new, new player. But I got the opportunity to play uh, 3.18 for some time. And as you can see, now I get the code. Uh, CIG service code 19,000. So to fix this problem, uh, what I think what we're going to do is uh, let's first uh, close this game first. Uh, so you can just Alt, you can hold Alt Tab, I'll bring you to this, and you can just close it from here. And now what I will do, I will try to delete everything. So let's close that. <clears throat> and what I will do, I go to my game. I think it's here. I have my. Uh, Star citizen, yes. Uh, so I will, without first thing, I'll do uh, probably. Um, I think this the RSI launcher is a is, a, is the problem. I think is, is here because it, it uh, kind of retains the credential and communicate with the server. So let's get rid of that and uh, delete this, yes. And then probably I go to program before. Let me just control Z to bring it back. And then I will go to uh, add remove programs from there. And I will re uh, <clears throat> uninstall it. I think this should be somewhere. Uh, I... Steam. Did I just missed it? Yes, here we go. And install. And install. Yes. Uh, and uninstall and I think you need to delete uh, all the related folders um, I think my folder was in C program files so you go to C or your main uh, direct uh, driver and there you go so you go C again program files double click and then you go to uh, Robert space industries I think you delete that delete yes uh, yes. <clears throat> so now it's gone. And another thing you need to delete, I think, uh, uh, if you go to command, 
uh, no, not it's not command prompt. I think uh, run. Yeah. Uh, in run, you see there is um, you put the percentage sign local app data and then percentage and then you go OK. And it will open for you a window like this. And now you look for a uh, property space somewhere here. It should be here. Uh, RSI launcher. So you're looking for that folder. And delete that one. Uh, delete that. And then we go to Star Citizen as well. Uh, delete that. So basically we have to delete everything. That's the whole point. Um, it, it will not like your your game. Your game is safe or your settings. Uh, maybe your settings will be messed up for sure. But it's a new uh, new version. So what shall we do? We have to do that. You have to you'd go to your key bind again. And if you save your profile somewhere in the cloud, then you're good to go. And I don't think it's saving the cloud too. It's still this game is still like not that at that level. So um, probably I'll have to do the key binding again from scratch, unfortunately. But we need to resolve this issue. Another thing you need to delete. So let's close this window first. Uh, close this one as well. Close this. I'll go again to the run command. Uh, and then there is another one called um, uh, same percentage app data. And percentage. I'll try to leave those two commands in the description of this video. So let's click OK. And you see there RSI uh, launcher. I also delete that one. Not delete. Now you delete all of everything now. Just yes, go back and it, you know download the game. Uh, I think if you have the down in your downloads, if you have the installer in your download, you can just go to your uh, downloads folder and uh, you can find it from here. Downloads, click here, or you can just go to your uh, computer folder and click on downloads. I'm not sure if we still, I still have, yeah, I have uh, RSI, so, so we just double click on that. And maybe I want to say no for now. I want to right click on that and run as administrator and say yes. Agree. Uh, install it in the program files, install. Just follow this, uh, like say next, yes, yes, and next. And then probably it will ask you to enter your credential again so it will launch yes I should launch it yes uh, let me close this and close the uh, Firefox close this folder I don't need them now I have to enter my credential again so please uh, bear with me I'll just um, uh, switch to blank screen uh, before I switch to blank screen actually I just received the message without before even i log in i received this message which says install so i didn't even log in and it says install new version of launcher has been downloaded and so i written so i say install um so it looks like there is a new version as well came came out with this uh, 3.18 so let's do that yeah finish. and say yes and now i have to enter my credential so let me do that uh, i'm just uh, putting my credential here, my email, and um, my password, basically. If you want to contact me, you don't need my email. Just comment on this video. <laughs> Hope it will help someone. And I'll sign in. So um, let me go take you back to the screen. So now it says, okay, uh, let me just put the volume a little bit down. After you um, will send your email uh, because you have two step authentication, it will send you a code. So let's see what's my code. Um, one second. I need to check. Uh, so it should receive an email that from property space with the authentication code on authentication so okay let me hide my screen because i will need to what i will do i will enter the code here and then this device and i will uh device duration i will select for one year okay and then i will hit authenticate but for now i will hide my screen just to put my authentication code here and i'm sorry about that
I'm just putting my authentication code now. And then I will hit authenticate. All right, now we're in. So let me take you back to the game. Uh, now we're in. So we have just to install the, the game now. This will take some time. So we hit install, acknowledge. It will take some time. So I will come back after it's finished installation. Okay, we almost uh, done. I have one gigabyte left. And as you can see, it's, a, it's pretty fast internet. So um, there is one thing I I think I should mention. I don't know how to do this, but uh, uh, since we delete everything, I think there is a way actually you can save your uh, your settings or the, your key bind. Um, I I don't I don't remember where I saw this. I think in one of these videos, one was explaining like you go to this your folder, the RSI folder somewhere. Uh, not the RSI, sorry, the uh, report space industry. Uh, and there uh, you will find your, um, you know, key points and your profile, basically. So um, since I delete everything, I, I lost that file, apparently. <laughs> and even if I uh, I knew that fa the fact that I can go there and retrieve my, my uh, or save it somewhere else, it's already too late because I don't know how to find find it. So if anyone uh, knows how to find, um, you know, how you save your setting before you delete everything, you save your profile, which contains a key point, please um, write down below in the comments to help someone else. And I'm sorry if I didn't mention that because I really don't know where to find it. I only know that is in the Robert Space Industries. So it's good to mention this now. Um, because I forgot to do that. Okay, we're almost there. Yep. Now we, uh, I'm not sure um, we will need to log in again because apparently it doesn't look like it's asking us to log in again. So um, hopefully <laughs> this will work. Let's see. P P PTU is still there, which is a good thing because in PTU, I think you have a free uh, Drake Vulture and uh, Reclaimer, those two massive ships for salvaging. I think you can go and practice for salvaging there. I'm not sure this will, um, if you join the PTU evaluation uh, period, I'm not sure if that will um, will come with your profile to live. I, I don't think so. But for now, let's launch and see if, if we still have, um, we don't have that error anymore, hopefully. One thing, this is not relevant. <laughs> if you notice, uh, most of these games, majority of games, the good games, they use um, easy anti-cheat. And you really wonder why Call of Duty, they don't use easy anti-cheat. Any idea? <laughs> I don't know why. But they have their own ricochet or whatever you call it, which is not really working. It's really bad anti-cheat software. Like really bad. Like you go any game, you find hackers. Um, but this easy as easy at digit like has a good reputation i believe oh my god this still we have the same error we have the account login failed mm, i i don't know let's let's try again press alt uh, tab let's let the music play in the background maybe first we need to close the uh, game close just to so you guys not get bored of my, my voice <laughs> um what i will do now um probably i will um, log out yeah and then close this and uh, let's look at the task manager make sure rsi launcher is not running in the background you see it's running you have to make sure you have to close it from the task manager and it's gone uh close this and let me move this full uh, shortcut up, up here, back here, and double click. Uh, yes. Now um, I'll put my credential. I'm sorry about that <laughs> again. <laughs> I'm just putting my credential now. Uh, 
and then I'm just putting my password. And then uh, we'll sign in. Okay. So the time it didn't ask me send um it didn't ask about sending the authentication code because we already from this PC uh, we already authenticated our server and we said keep it for one year, keep the IP address of this PC. So um let's uh, launch again. Why is the game? knowledge if it, if it didn't allow me to log in then this is an issue to be need to be reported so hopefully this video will be as a report for CIG like um, I don't know how to fix this error to be honest I think there is a, a website where you can you know send a report I will try to find that and send the report um, if you encounter the same error and um, you have a solution, uh, please write down in the comments and help me <laughs> to get back to the game and play. <laughs> I will appreciate that. Uh, yeah, here we go. So, okay, that's it. Uh, this is the end of the video. Uh, we can't log in to our uh, lovely 3.18. And thank you for watching. Uh, the news channel is this new channel for... Um, uh you know uh video gaming whatever it is a uh, game i play like uh star citizen one of the games so help the channel to grow please subscribe uh thank you and have a good day